we are starting things off with this awesome looking college stadium you have the college in the background right over there you have the stadium right here 4,000 capacity a couple other college dorms and other college buildings a couple parking lots along the stadium as well practice field right over here and a football stadium here with some stands as well and looking at the lighting as well it is nicely lit i would like the background to be lit a little bit more i mean you can see the light lighting that up over there but left field is a little dim i mean i'm talking about that right there but overall besides Besides that, the stadium looks really, really good. Great job. Here's the next one we are looking at. This is kind of more basic, but it's a high school stadium. So you got the football field right over here, practice field, couple tennis courts, even have a batting cage in the distance. I like this little building in the background, just a normal, like a shed or something like that. They added a lot of details. You even have just a random trash can over here for the football slash track field. Really nicely done. And they even have a walkway going all the way down here. I love that a lot. Uh, they did put a lot of effort and detail into the stadium even behind the stadium itself you have a couple buildings and storage areas you even have another batting cage right over there lighting itself looks really nice as well would we'll like to see the practice field and the football field to be lit but you are at 100 storage so maybe cut down on some of the trees so you can add more lighting but other than that a really nice job here's the next one we are taking a look at this is another awesome looking field and i love the practice field up on that hill and behind the main stadium you have the soccer field even have a neighborhood right over here as well as a basketball court this is a university so it is a college town and they did a really nice job on that i love the detail for the college town and all the little small details as well the lighting on the main field looks really nice you even lit up the practice field but maybe light up the background a little bit more like right over there even the parking lot should be lit and even back there just so when you're behind home plate and you hit a foul ball or even a home run you can actually see the background right over there i do love the way it looks at night the practice field being up on the hill so overall it's a really nice stadium a little bit more lighting awesome job here's the next one we are taking a look at definitely one of the best in this video absolutely love it let's take a deeper dive first of all i love that the city is up kind of if, if that makes sense it's above ground compared to where the baseball field is that looks really really awesome i love the road the bridge and of course the college itself looks really realistic nicely done over here in left you have a bridge and a bunch of hills center field looks great i love the welcome to fortmanville park i love that sign and overall i mean looking at it from behind on plate looks beautiful and taking a look at the lighting as well nicely lit everything is nice and bright maybe light up the bridge just a little bit over there and left but other than that it's a really nice stadium great job here's the next one we are taking a look at it's just a stadium but i thought it was still pretty good this is old miss stadium so i think it's based off of the actual stadium 10,000 capacity looks really really awesome i love that they made custom bullpens in left and right field and the custom stands over there in left as well looks really realistic a little building in the background scoreboard on top of that right field looks pretty much the same and you have a couple concessions and signs as well and then taking a look at the lighting as well nicely lit overall it's a really nice stadium great job here's the next one we are looking at another college stadium and this one looks really really awesome first of all we have the nice college town in the background we have the football field right over here as well as the soccer field right over there nice big parking lot you also have the college right over here and you even have some dorm buildings right over there the stadium itself looks pretty nice and taking a look at the lighting the field itself is nicely lit you can see what you need to see but i mean overall good job here's the next one we are taking a look at this one is a pretty nice stadium it's mostly just a stadium you have a couple buildings in the background for the college and then you also have 8,000 capacity a bigger college i like the scenery in the background the trees the hills 
even have a parking lot over here and right the college itself is right over here and i believe this is florida state university at least that's what the name is so it should be based off of their baseball field which i'm a huge fsu fan so can definitely appreciate the stadium also taking a look at the lighting itself everything is lit perfectly what you need to see you can see so nicely done i love the scoreboard over there and left as well overall really nice stadium starting things off with this amazing looking stadium submitted by one of you guys this is diamond stadium taking a look at it from behind home plate look how beautiful that is you have the mountains in the background just center field alone looks amazing you have a custom bullpen right over here and over here and you have the bullpen benches as well and i like the strikeout meter right above the bullpens as well looked really awesome and taking a look at the lighting as well nice and beautiful overall what a great stadium to start the video here's the next one we are looking at this one is for the montreal expos look at the stadium itself the city is also very awesome nice big Big parking lot as well but this over here is my favorite part the expos logo oh my gosh how creative is that and it looks like it's made out of trash cans so kind of houston astros related too <laughs> we got some retired expos greats over here in left field i love what they did with the roof as well and the lighting on the stadium is absolutely beautiful no dim spots everything is lit perfectly overall what a great job on the stadium here's the next one we are looking at this one looks really awesome i love the scoreboard in dead center with the crown on top over in right field you have a very interesting building over here i like what they did with the buildings floating and even the crane because when you're at home plate level does not look like that crane is floating neither do the buildings look like they're floating so really nice touch on that i like this little area over here it says fox sports midwest i like that did they make that custom they did over here on left you have the world series champions in 85 in 2015 and you have the royals hall of fame right over here in right field taking a look at the lighting as well very very bright no dim spots at all overall it's a beautiful ballpark definitely a good job here's the next one we are taking a look at this one is unique because we don't see many in the country so i like this a lot you have a bunch of props and it's just a giant farm i love it you also have a racetrack right over here in right field a couple of barns in the background you even have a small airport and a hotel over there you also have a bunch of windmills and even hot air balloons as well very very creative i like it a lot here is the lighting as well looks really really good but if we go behind home plate it looks like you need a little bit of light in the background just so you can see a little bit more but overall it's still a really nice stadium i love the creativity behind it great job here's the next one we are looking at this one is a military baseball field as well as just a complex overall dedicated to those who are serving in the u.s army the navy the military overall thank you for your service but anyways we're going to look at this stadium you have a bunch of airplanes i like the little white house on top of the hill you also have something dedicated to the navy with the water and the boats over there you have the football field right over here as well as a soccer field tennis court and a basketball court right over there taking a look at the lighting for the baseball field not the worst and also taking a look at the background you can see the airplanes and you can even see the white house in the background i like the scoreboard on that tower as well overall it's a nice stadium dedicated to those who are serving in the u.s army thank you guys so much for all you do here's the next stadium we are looking at this one looks really really awesome this is an old stadium and I, first of all i absolutely love the outside of the stadium it looks really really nice 
definitely gives me old vibes as well especially the entrance that looks really really nice as well you have a neighborhood in the background small parking lot over there you also have some hills and trees in the distance and of course since it's an old stadium you have the bleachers and the lighting itself is really nice as well starting things off with this incredible looking stadium it definitely gives me vibes that it's a really old stadium and i love that they used so much green they kept that color going throughout the entire stadium on the outside you have a nice little city inside the stadium itself looks beautiful i love the stands they did a really nice job on that the batter's eye is beautiful they did a really nice job old hickory it's a hit i love the custom sponsor signs also taking a look at the lighting nice and bright no dim spots definitely a beautiful ballpark nice job here's the next stadium we are taking a look at this one definitely looks beautiful it looks a lot like Camden yards i guess just because the warehouse building going all the way around i mean look at it from behind home plate wow they did such a nice job i love it and they even put some stands up there on top of the building and even inside there oh my gosh i love that a lot dead center looks beautiful the batter's eye and overall it's a 33,000 capacity stadium you also have some concessions in left and right corner taking a look at the lighting as well nice and bright no dim spots at all they did a really nice job on this ballpark here's the next one we are taking a look at this one has a lot of mountains in the background including some stands on the mountains and some lighting on the mountains really nice touch with that looking at it from behind home plate i mean take a look at this nice beautiful view in left field a nice little deck area where you can sit under the umbrella and watch the game bunch of concessions over there left field in general looks pretty awesome and i like this little corner in right center field and a bunch of stands and a giant scoreboard in right field as well as a couple buildings in the background also taking a look at it at night nice and bright no dim spots overall a beautiful ballpark here's the next one we are looking at this one looks really awesome and it's another old looking stadium i love these older looking stadiums and in right field i just i absolutely love those stands left field you got the old bleachers some old warehouse buildings in the background for the neighborhood i mean take a look at all the detail for the outside of the stadium and even inside the stadium looks really really nice as well now taking a look at the lighting as well it is nice and bright no dim spots at all i mean just overall a beautiful ballpark here's the next stadium this one i found on reddit i believe it's actually still from one of my viewers but this is a new rogers center very accurate to the current rogers center i mean just look at this thing it looks exactly like it dead center you have the apartments hotels whatever they are in the background the giant scoreboard i mean left field looks exactly like what i see on tv you have concessions up at the top the bullpen over here in left field as well and even in right field you have the custom bullpen right field looks accurate as well again more concessions up top nice little party area over here and even back there more concessions i mean this place is beautiful looks a lot like rogers center from what i've seen on tv and taking a look at the lighting no dim spots whatsoever nice and bright very accurate overall they did a fantastic job on rebuilding rogers center next stadium we are looking at this one is very unique there's a lot going on you have a big city in the background you also have this hill in the back with the scoreboard on it a couple fun things in the background such as a statue hit it here sign and you even have a clock tower right back there trying to hotel and over here you have a stage of course you gotta have some concerts and other performances and even the lighting is absolutely beautiful definitely my my favorite part of the ballpark and i love that they made the seats red it definitely stands out big time for the stadium overall they did a nice job on this one this next one is from 1948 we have ebbets field and let me just tell you the outside alone 
looks super realistic and beautiful couple buildings around but i'm talking about this part here it makes it look like a real stadium i mean take a look at that amazing i love that they have ebbets field right up here a couple american flags around as well and looking at it from behind home plate definitely a stadium you want to play at online road to the show whatever it may be even have some concessions or buildings in the background and more restaurants behind the stadium as well looking at the lighting as well no dim spots beautiful ballpark I love it, love it, love it, especially because it's from 1948. I love these old ballparks. Definitely a great job. This next one is kind of a dome stadium. This is in Miami. You have a giant dome over here and it says Go Sox. I don't know what team that is in Miami. You also have the Ferris wheel and all of the palm trees. You also have a water slide in the background. Definitely Florida, Miami vibes. Love it a lot. I like the giant scoreboard going all the way around. It's a curved giant scoreboard and a lot of seating as well. Taking a look at the lighting for a stadium like this, they did a really, really good job lighting it up, especially with the roof. Overall, it's a beautiful ballpark great job here's the next one we are looking at first of all i love left field with this giant maze in the background maze slash garden you also have a bunch of buildings in the back as well over here in right field you have triple deck seating very very nice you also have the hall of fame numbers and in left field you have some fountains and some nice shady seating as well taking a look at the lighting nice and bright i like the seats being blue a lot of people lack on coloring the seats, but I've been seeing it more, especially in this showcase video. And looking at the outside of the stadium, they did a really nice job making it look like a real entrance right over here. So definitely big props to them on adding all these small little details. Overall, a really nice ballpark. Here's the next one we are checking out. And I love this one because they built it on kind of street level where the street connects with the entrance here. They really added a bunch of details into this and really went into depth. I mean, even just having a couple plants on the outside of the stadium, the trees. And I love this over here in right center, the USN field on top of that scoreboard. Over here in left, you also have the Ultimate Sports Network. Absolutely love that. I don't know if it's real, like a real sports network, but I like it. Very custom and creative. Looking at it from behind home plate is beautiful. I love the city in the background. Awesome. I love the creativity behind the stadium. Looking at the lighting as well, orange seating, and it's a very bright stadium. They lit up the background as well. Overall, what a great job on the stadium. Speaking of great jobs on stadiums, click on one of the videos on the screen right now to check out some more awesome stadiums. Also, if you have an awesome stadium you want me to showcase, click the link in the description down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you in my next video.